Hello friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can use the tool Stiffening Rib Stamp in Kitsia V5. This particular tool is coming under the Generated Sheet Metal Design Workbench and uh, to demonstrate go to Start, Mechanical Design and uh, you could go to Generated Sheet Metal Design Workbench click on OK and once you're on the workspace set the sheet metal parameters as usual and uh, go for a basic wall and create the wall and to demonstrate the stiffening rib stamp you need to have a bend so in order to do that select the one of the edges and go for wall on edge tool and then go for OK and you get the wall on edge. So basically this particular stamping is used to uh, give support uh, for uh, bend walls. So here what you could do is uh, really firstly select the tool. How you can select the tool is you could go to insert stamping and you have the stiffening rib stamp over here. Alternately you can go for cutting stamping toolbar here's the cutting stamping toolbar and you have the stiffening rib stamp over here select the tool and then you will be asked to select the cylindrical surface so while selecting the cylindrical surface one thing you need to keep in mind is you need to select the outer cylindrical surface so once you select the outer cylindrical surface you get the stamp the rib stamp over there now what you could really do is uh, maybe increase the length and uh, you could increase the radius etc. Now just go for uh, the preview and you can see the preview over here. So you have an option to disable the radius one. If you if you just disable the radius one, what you have is uh, this this filleting on either of these uh, different faces won't be available. And uh, you have the radius two, which is this radius and uh, you could also change the radius one here and you have an option to increase or decrease the angle so that increase that uh, you know really opens this portion here and uh, that's all the parameters explained for stiffening rib stem I hope uh, this tutorial will help you on your sheet metal projects and working and uh, if you have any doubt on this particular tutorial tutorial please uh, please comment below the video and I'll be getting in touch with you if you have any CAD related projects or inquiries you could write to me at ketia.pro.user at gmail.com and uh, st stay tuned and thank you for watching